Welcome to the SAP Business One HANA series showcasing the analytical portal. One of the principal elements in a company is to have access to reports at any time, anywhere. The analytical portal provides a gateway to reports like Crystal Reports or Microsoft Excel that can be published or shared with other users. In my Google Chrome web browser, I am able to log into the analytical portal as a super user, Jason Butler. And to do this, I've selected my relevant server, my company database, and then I enter my username and password. Jason has authorization to see all Crystal Reports and Excel reports as a super user. The reports are categorized into the different modules. The Excel reports have the Excel symbol next to the report name, and Crystal Reports are shown with the diamond next to the Crystal Report name. In this view, Jason is able to mark the important reports as favorites by clicking on the star symbol. So in this case, he's going to mark the sales opportunities report and the annual sales analysis by quarter report. After he marks, for example, these reports, the reports tab is now active and he can select on the favorite reports menu option and here listed under the categories are his favorite reports. Jason would like to run the annual sales analysis by quarter report and schedule it for several users. To run a report, you simply select the All Reports tab, and in this tab, you can click on the report that you would like to schedule. So in this case, it will be the annual sales analysis by quarter. You then need to select the document type, the posting date year, which we will enter 2017, and also the customer group, for example. So for all customers and then we select the run option. Here we then can see the annual sales analysis report by quarter based on the filters that we entered previously. We then have the option to print the report or of course to download the report accordingly. You also have the option to email the report to relevant recipients. If we navigate back to the all reports menu, we can see that there is a little red icon next to the annual sales analysis report. This is the history icon. When you click on the history icon, you can now see a report running history of this report. It lists all historical data, even if the report run fails. For example, if you added the incorrect date. Jason would now like to schedule a report. Let's navigate back to our all reports. There are two options for scheduling reports. You can run the report again, like we've just done, and then you can click on the schedule icon that appears, enabling you to set the scheduled options. Or, next to your reports, you've got an option called schedule. And here you can set the relevant settings. So we're simply going to select schedule. In this case, we're going to schedule the sales analysis by quarter report to a number of employees. You first need to select your document type, the posting date, customer group, which will be for all customers, the format, but because this is a crystal report, the only format that is available is PDF in this example. You can then enter the frequency and time range that this report will be triggered. So you might want to trigger this report weekly, for example, start at a particular time, and you've got the option to select an end date, which in this case will be the end of the year. You can also select an option to choose how long you would like to keep the history of running these reports. And finally, we select who's going to receive these reports. We're going to select Bill Levine and also Donna Brown. We then need to name our report schedule. And now that we've scheduled a report, our report scheduling tab is now active. So if we click on the report scheduling, here we can see all of the reports that we've scheduled. This is a simple example of how to access important information independent of time and location using the SAP Business One analytical portal.